Hi, my name is Dave Klappenberger. I'm with Klappenberger and Son Painting, and today we're going to take a look at a paint that you might not have heard of. It's called C2. You can't find it in big box stores like Home Depot. You can either A, get it online, or B, you can call up about four or five thousand independent paint stores that probably carry it. I'm sure there's one in your area that would love to do business with you. The C2 paint uh, that we're going to apply today is a matte finish and it comes in sheens all the way from flat, matte, big shell, satin, semi-gloss, and even a gloss. So it comes in a variety of sheens. It's sort of uniqueness is that it's the only paint that I'm aware of that doesn't use black as a pigment. They ground their pigments longer than most paints do so it, it should help with the coverage of the paint. It's a premium grade paint. That means, it used to mean a premium grade paint meant that it cost 40, 50, maybe $60. Now premium grade paints mean they cost 60 to $110. The C2 falls into the category of $72.99, I believe. You can get it online. Uh, and it doesn't matter whether you buy a flat or a gloss. It's $72.99 across the board. One way that C2 does save you some money is if you go to one of the independent paint stores, they'll send, they'll, they have these huge samples that you can take home with you. And you can bring them back when you decide what you want because I'm sure they cost some money. And you can put them up on the wall and without buying a quart of paint, which is about 25 bucks, you could take home three or four of these things, save $100, make sure you get the color you want and you know that C2 can match this color perfectly because it's in their system and they don't use any blacks like other companies might have a hard time matching up the C2 colors because they use different colorants. I like the way it spread. It had good workability. I could get about 24 to 30 inches out of one dip of a brush. I could get about 27 square feet out of rolling. The can says that it gets between 400 and 450 square feet a gallon, and the industry standard is about 300 to 350. So that extra 100 square feet or so is a 25% increase. So even though the paint might be a little bit more expensive, you're, it's going a lot further, reducing the overall cost of the paint. So I like the workability. I like the coverage as well. This paint covers very easily in two coats. Even an amateur painter who's not very skilled at this can easily get this paint to cover in two coats. C2 matte finish is a low VOC paint. I had the windows cracked. There was still a smell of paint in the air. My daughter came over about two hours after I was done painting and said, oh, I smell that. I can smell that you painted. So there is a lingering effect with the odor, but it was very moderate. And the splatter of the paint was minimal. Yes, there was some blue splatters on the baseboard, but nothing to get too excited about, being that I was gonna paint the baseboard anyway. Just use some drop cloths and you shall be fine. Now, we're gonna let the paint cure for 14 days, and then we're gonna give it a washability and durability test. All right, we have some crayon, pencil mark, mustard, ketchup, uh, cabernet, and some dark French roast coffee. Time to get some crud cutter and go ahead and, that says crud cutter, and go ahead and spray it on. Watch the mustard turn orangey. And let's see what this bad boy does. The C2 matte finish turned out to be a very washable paint. After two minutes and 11 seconds of cleaning the walls to get that mustard stain off and the ketchup and the mustard, it all came off, but so did a teeny bit of paint, just a little bit of blue hue, but the coffee stain's gone, the, the wine stain's gone, the crayons, pencil marks, ketchup, mustard, gone. whoops, there's a little teeny bit left in that angle. You can see a little bit of yellow there, but in this angle, it's completely gone. The durability of this paint was also fantastic. No burnishing of the wall. The overall finish looked untouched, unscathed by the two minutes and 11 seconds of cleaning. Let's review Luxie Matte Finish by C2. I like the paint a lot. The workability of this paint was a 10 out of 10. The washability and durability, getting those stains off and not seeing any burnishing on the walls of where we did clean and where we didn't clean, 10 out of 10. For a matte finish, 
very impressive. The value of this paint at $72.99 is my only concern. Is it worth it? Is it worth a premium grade cost like that when you can get other paints for maybe $45, $50 with some of these same characteristics. And I would argue that because the coverage goes about 20 to 25% further than most paints do, that you could per perhaps buy fewer gallons of paint because the coverage of each gallon is extending further than what its competition, its competitors are doing. And the coverage is so good. You're covering this thing in two coats. This Paint covers very well because of the finely graded, graded artesian pigments. So that makes this a really good value and makes the $72.99 a little bit easier to stomach. Furthermore, you have the poster size sample colors that you can put on the wall allowing you not to buy quarts of paint and use brushes and throw all this stuff away. We don't need that. Just bring the poster size samples home put them on the walls, and instantly you see what two solid coats of paint will look like. That, again, adds more value and makes the $72.99 more stomachable. So if you're looking for something with all these benefits, I think the C2 paint from Luxie Matte Finish is a great product for you.